Hello, my fellow YouTubers. This is Roy back again. Today, I'm um, finishing up on that uh, 555 timer circuit. And I started stripping everything down and uh, pulling stuff off of it. And pretty much, this is what I have left of it. Just wires connected and just this resistor. I mean, not resistor, I mean transistor. Okay. And this is what we got. Lighten up light bulbs. Crazy. Ain't nothing there. Nothing there but a transistor. Let me turn these lights out. Show you what I was monkeying around with here. Yeah. Lighten them up nice, huh? Lighten them up nice. Crazy. Look at this stuff. Look at that glow in there. See that, guys? It's crazy. So, Slayer Circuit, huh? Ain't got nothing to it. Ain't got nothing to it. Pretty much just a transistor. Look at that lighting up. As you can see inside that light bulb, it's pretty cool. It's like little flames. And if you touch it, um, it doesn't really shock you. But it burns. <laughs> burns a lot. Burns a lot. It's got good coverage. I mean, it's lighting up light bulbs. Look how far out I am from the. You know what I mean, so it's got good pickup space. Just working off of a 12 volt battery. Pretty interesting stuff. Pretty interesting stuff. So yeah. So um, if anybody wants to. Light up light bulbs without uh, plugging them into the wall. Uh, I'll post a video if you guys want. Just leave a leave a comment. I'll post a video on uh, how to put this together. And this is nothing but a simple. It was off of my five five five. I tore it all apart, so I just got wires all together here and and run into my uh, transistor. There ain't no resistor, no diodes, no no um, no capacitors. You can see that lighting up that purple one, huh? Pretty cool. You can see some good flames coming out of it. Good arcs. Nice and purple too. Just way cool. So yeah, and then I was after I got into that, I got into myself. Uh, you know, learning about the primary, you know, you got um, thicker wire, more wraps, thicker wire, less wraps, thinner wire, less wraps. So I'm just um, looking at everything's going on. I'm seeing like flames jumping out or not flames, but like some kind of cool lighting coming out of it it's almost like opening up pandora's box you don't know what's inside of it you know it's got every time i take a look at it she's got some cool cool arcs coming out of it but um yeah so leave comments guys uh do i really know exactly what i did <laughs> Can't really say, but but I was just working on that timer because I wanted to use the timer instead of a, a relay, like, like, like electronic timer. Uh, this setup here is charging my capacitor. I am using a 12-volt battery. Uh, this does go to my, um, my um, solar panel, directly to solar panel with no inverters or nothing. And today I had that running this also. So that's even more exciting because that's free energy there. I don't care which way you flip it or dip it. Uh, solar panel, 
to these towers here are free. And then I'm messing with the ground to see what um, what we got going with the ground. And right here, this is coming straight off that ground. And you can see, look at that. You can see the arcs is coming out of it. It's crazy. It's got like a stream, like, like a beautiful just jet stream coming out of it. So, um, yeah, pretty cool stuff. Look at that. It's like a laser because I put a piece of paper up there and um, I can catch a damn paper on fire. I've got one hand. Let me see if I can do this without burning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you see that, guys? Come over here. And... Burn the paper. Ooh. Yep, see that all burnt up? Burn my finger too, huh? Look at that burn mark on my finger. Meanwhile. So, interesting stuff. I don't know very much about the Slayer setup, but I see you guys out there messing with them. And there you go. This one is just basically just a transistor you guys peace out leave some comments